ክቡር ፕሬዝዳንት ፖል ካጋሜ ላስተላለፎት መልእክት ከልብ የመለጨ መስካይናን ያቀርብኩ ቀጥሎ የደቡብ አፍሪካ ሪፐብሊክ ፕሬዝዳንት ክቡር ጃኮብ ዙማ መልእክታቸውን እንዲያቀርቡ በታላቅ አክብሮት ጋብዛለሁ acting prime minister of the federal republic of ethiopia excellencies heads of state and government chairperson of the au his excellency bonyai chairperson of the au commission distinguished guests the 20th of august 2012 was a sad day on the calendar of the african union and africa as we lost one of the greatest sons of the continent his excellency prime minister meles zenawi This is a painful period for the people of Ethiopia to lose such a young leader a patriot and a visionary with prime minister Zanawi at the helm a generation of Ethiopians has seen their country emerge from hunger and destitution to be a fast growing economy the policies of his party and government have delivered a sustained double digit economic growth rate if this continues his beloved ethiopia will become a middle income country indeed his legacy is defined by the sprawling city that addis has become the stability that ethiopia enjoys and its new found ability to provide food for its people his ideas we framed around the need to achieve social justice for his people and conquer poverty not just in ethiopia but in all of africa as an african leader we are proud of meles zenawi and the leadership he provided on issues affecting the continent around the globe he took a leading role on africa's negotiations on climate change in peace making in sudan and in the fight to bring stability back in somalia prime minister meles accedency as a liberation fighter and then later as a leader of ethiopia was due to the force of his intellect which not many could match he was ready to engage in debate with policy makers diplomats and scholars from around the world He was invited to groups of powerful nations such as the G8 and G20 not only 
due to the size or history of his country, but mainly due to the size of his ideas. Malas was a builder of institutions. He played a prominent role in the NAPAD Heads of State and Government Implementation Committee and formed a solid alliance between Ethiopia and South Africa in our joint efforts to promote the African Renaissance. South Africa has always considered Ethiopia as one of the anchor states and a leading country in the Horn of Africa. And with Meles at the helm, we were always assured of support and encouragement. On behalf of the people and the government of the Republic of South Africa, I extend my deepest condolences to the family and friends of Prime Minister Meles Zanawi and to all the people of Ethiopia. We also extend our condolences to the party that Prime Minister Zenawi led, the Ethiopian People's Revolutionary Democratic Front, a close ally of the African National Congress, South Africa's ruling party and liberation movement. Undeniably, our colleague, friend, and comrade has left a lasting impression in Ethiopia and on the continent as a whole. We should, as a collective within the institution whose headquarters he generously hosted, advance his achievements in honor of his contribution and leadership. Farewell, my dear brother and comrade. May his soul rest in eternal peace. I thank you.